Welcome to the show. Hello everyone and welcome to another how to video today. I'm trying to push out as much um, How to's and content as I can because today is the last day. I will be uploading Until the end of July. I mean until the end of August. Sorry <clears throat> So in this video I will be showing you guys how to complete all the monthly awards quickly so let's use the April as an example. So the first card you get is the Cedric Mullins. And in this pack, you get uh, Yamin Mercedes, Nate Lau, Akil Badu, and Kyle Isbell, I think his name is. And then you get Danny Duffy, who is a really good pitcher. Um, he's a really good gold pitcher. Nick Solak, I've seen, I see, um, a decent amount of people still have him on his team because of his stats. He is a good starter card. I personally have him parallel one, but I personally don't like his swing. But that doesn't mean that you guys shouldn't. Try the, I'd recommend to try this card out. So, I'm just going to run you guys through this and how to get it done as quick as I did. Um, and in this pack, we have diamonds and gold. Um... B Ryan McCann, he is a really good budget third baseman. Um, now we have Matt Barnes, who's a pretty good closer. The Shoei Otani card, I've had him, he was the last guy to be taken out of my team uh, so far. He was a really good card for me. I got him to pay a level three and me using him. <clears throat> we also have this Justin Turner card, who was also pretty good. And we have this Vladimir Guerrero Jr. I would 100% recommend putting him on your team if you don't have any good first baseman. He is a really good card. Corbin Burns, who dominated the game for a while. I have him parallel 3. And of course, the Lightning card, Brian Buxton, who I have parallel 4. So, um, and you also get a blue bat skin. Uh, for this one, I personally still use that bat skin. So, first, I'd recommend doing all or um, most of these moments. If you do all, uh, most of these moments, it should get you um, to just before Nick Solak. And then with that Danny Duffy card, that um, Cedric Mullins, and that Cedric Mullins card, it will help um you get that nick solak card so you just want to do all or m all of these missions besides maybe two um i missed two but i still got them because of the collections so i'd recommend doing all of them but two missions sorry i had the moments one up sorry um and that will get if you do all of those missions that will get you this top snap Pack, Matt Barnes, Shohei Otani, um, Justin Turner, Vladimir Guerrero Jr., Corbin Burns, and up to around this ball and is a habit pack. Or I say if you do all of the missions and moments, it'll get you a bit before that Bayern Buxton. <clears throat> now for the collection. So you need to do tops now you can miss out on i think it's a couple of cards i only missed out on that ja hat because i did not feel like buying him uh april's uh tops now moments were pretty simple but it was just one of them th that i couldn't get through and i would not recommend selling the tops now cards that you get out of these packs because you can put them in this collection and remember, don't get duplicates out of the pack unless you already have um, both of the card options. Then just go for the one that sells for the most. So that's for the April. Oh, by the way, you need to do tops now moments. Or if you don't feel like doing all the moments, you can just buy the cards. But that will be a lot of stubs. So you just go to tops now 2021. Scroll all the way down since this is the April. You're going to want to do... Uh, the opening weekend, um, the April 5th through uh, 11th, April 12th through 18th, 
April 19th through 25th. This is the one that I did not do, and I'm pretty sure you also need this one. And at the end, you got a pretty good lightning card. So say if another uh, lightning outfielder card comes out, Brian Buxton might not be viable. He might be a good bench player, mainly because of his fielding and speed. And also, he's a contact power mix. So he will be very good, especially if you get him super packed, um, since it unlocks a secret cork. And he also has a bunch of quirks with that as well. He has, um, I think that was three pages worth of quirks. Mm -hmm. Now, as for the May, you're gonna wanna do the same, but you get uh, diamond cards right off the bat. Austin Meadows, I personally don't like his card, but I kept it in my team, because he was the uh, best left fielder I had um, up until um, the stage, when the stage three came out. So, <clears throat> these are the packs you'll get. Um, so that's the first one You'll also get this Jesse Winker. I personally don't like his card um, This Brandon Crawford. He was my shortstop for a while. He's a nice budget shortstop Brian to pair. He was in my bullpen for a while. He's pretty good. I've got to say Ramon Laureano, um, I Practically never had him on my team besides when I had to do the missions for him um, we have this Koi Kluber. He was in my starting rotation for a while. Jose Abreu was never my first baseman. Zach Wheeler was in my rotation for a bit. You get also get a 42 pack. Um, I'd recommend getting someone like um, that 42 Mariano Rivera. So if you don't have him already, he's a really good reliever. And at the end, you get this Marcus Simeon. I personally don't like his card. He just doesn't have that good of a swing. It's just that I kept him in because sometimes he'd be good for me. And also because of that defense at second base. So you mainly want to do the same thing. Do all of the... Um, I did all the missions personally. And all the moments. Oh wait, never mind. Besides one. So you want to do most of the moments. Again, that will get you to around 38. Just, I mean, 29. 28 sorry just before that Brandon Crawford so you'll get that um, Austin Meadows tops that tops now pack um, a thousand stubs Jesse Winker and that um, tops now pack well sorry the show pack and again do the collections they added more cards to this collection than they did the last one but for this one you need every single card you can get now for the June it's mainly the same thing, but for the June, in my opinion, um, in my opinion, Kyle Schwarber is 100% still viable uh, catcher. He has a secondary of catcher. I'd recommend putting him there <clears throat> if you do get him. You have the Screen Lightning Bat, another 42 pack, Ka Bang Bang Correa, Jonathan Scope, Brian Reynolds, Ryan Presley, Tommy Pham, Tyler Glass now, Charlie Morton. And Tyler Stevenson. In my opinion, I don't like Tyler Stevenson. It was so hard for me to complete his mission. Uh, I think it's two home runs or three extra base hits, something like that. Yeah, it was three extra base hits. Um, I I did every single m mission, I mean moment, sorry, um, besides one. Um, as for the collection, I think you need to, yeah, you need to get every single card in this. And the last one, July. Uh, in July was the most disappointing one so far, in my opinion. Um, you get Kendall Graveman, Frank Mokadis, Frankie Montas, sorry, Austin Riley, Kyle Farmer, Brandon Lau, Rocky Bueller, AJ Pollock, Harrison Bader, and that Joey Votto card. He is a good defender for first base. There's not a lot of good defenders besides that Eddie Murray card, of course. But this guy has a nice mix of power and contact. So if you want to, you can even keep him on your bench. So for this one, I did every single um, moment, but I missed out on uh, two missions. Um, then I completed the collections. You, by the way, you need to complete the collections in order to uh, do this. Um, the Swaka Bueller card is actually really good. 
so I'd recommend if you just complete it and you have like not that good of a team I'd recommend putting him at your starting position or like as a starter and if we get another 42 pack I'd recommend getting someone like Babe Ruth he has nice power good bench bat if you have like a low level team or that Ken Griffey he's a, he has a nice mix between defense contact and power it's just versus lefties where he does not do that good <clears throat> so in order to complete this you, again you need to do all the top snow moments or if say if you wanted to just buy the cards you can also do that but I would not recommend it because it, that's just a waste of stubs so do that and you also need to build a team uh, with top snow players and also players in that that come in that so top as for top snow players what I did is I'm pretty sure I did some secondaries here um I put in Mike Talkman I think it was um but no actually I had Byron Bucks in there I'm pretty sure because I was trying to parallel him so that's the only reason I kept him in Esteban Floyal um I kept Ronald Acuna because I wanted three cards that he could, that I knew that I could get base hits with, and the other card was JT Valmuta. Uh, at shortstop, I had uh, Ha Seong Kim. At third base, I had I think it was Brian McGann. At second base, I think I had that this card. And I put Brandon Lau in later on, of course. Um, at first base, I did Prince Fielder because I wanted a card that I could hit with again. But at first, I also did have Miguel Sano. He's a really good power bat for this. Um, and so this is how your team should look like just before you get that Joey Votto card. Um, let me try and find all the players. I think there was a third baseman. Where are you, Austin Riley? Okay, right here. Um, so this is how your team should have looked like while trying to, you know, like complete everything. So this is how my team would have looked like if I decided to do, like, if I did not do it as quickly as I did. So when I did it, I just rushed through it, did every single mission I could. Um, I got out of every game after I did, like, someone's mission. So, besides the first two games, I played those games out. Oh, and AJ Pollock. Sorry. I had him on my bench. So, this is almost like how your team should look like after it. Um, this is probably my best squad I could put together with that. Um, with trying to keep the theme of, you know, like, tops now. And, um, <clears throat> tops now and the cards that I came with. That came with uh, July. So thank you guys for joining me. That will be it for this video. I might be posting a how-to later on how to quickly. Um, I'm actually not sure if I'm gonna post another how-to. If I if it is, I it might be game mechanics, like how to do like different game mechanics, like PCI or even uh, pinpoint pitching. And yeah, thank you guys for joining me uh, for this video of how to complete the monthly awards. Peace out, guys.